go to Reed. Reed hand passes it to Whitcomb. Whitcomb's gone short. He finds Darcy 35 metres out from goal, almost directly in front. Only a young player. Maybe this will be the first goal of the match. Let's see what he does with this one. It's a high drop cut. The goal up by doesn't move at all. First goal of the match, and the Cats hit the front. Pass here, but he kicks high up towards the forward line. Up they go. The high flyers are there. Taken away by Carey. Forced through. This could be touched. Well, it's a goal, in fact. Kicked off the ground by Malcolm Reed. And the Cats are right a very good game, Stephen Reynoldson at half forward. He kicks towards the pocket. Darcy is from behind. He's marked it, I think. Yes, a very good mark by the young player, Tim Darcy. We've been playing about 21 minutes into this second quarter. Darcy, a very acute angle. He fires at the goals with the drop punt. It is swinging, and what is it? It is a goal. A great goal kicked by Tim Darcy. His drum, good play by the young player for Geelong. He screams away and kicks it towards half forward where the mark is taken down there by Tim Darcy, who kicked two goals for Geelong in the first half. Now, Big Mossop is down there against Andrews. He should get it down there quickly. It's a long raking torpedo. This could be a goal. I think it is. It is a goal. Kicked by Tim Darcy for his third, and the Cats hit back. The short pass, they got the loose man and Brian Peake. No, it's not Peake, in fact, marking the ball at half It Could be Tim Darcy again, I think. Lining up for goal number four. Maybe this is the young fella's day as he lines up 30 metres out. The drop part, it's a high one. It's floating. I think he's kicked it. He has four goals to Tim Darcy. A great effort by the young bloke.